let's work on question six in this video. So we spent 500 euros on two goods, food and clothing, I guess. The utility is given as F square plus C square. So that matters. The price is five and the price of clothing is 10. How much should we buy? Okay, so let's set up our Lagrange and play a bit with the math. It's pretty pretty mechanical, but it's, uh, it's wise to, to get really used to it. So we maximize the function the utility function f square plus c square minus lambda times our constraint and let's write the constraint here so we know what that is the price of food is 5 times the units of food plus the price of clothing is 10 times the units of clothing equals to the income of 500 so we put that here 5f plus 10 times c minus 500 and now we take the partial derivatives with respect to food and then with respect to clothing make that equals to zero so the partial derivative of the Lagrange with respect to f f squared derivative with respect to f is just 2f here we have nothing with f and then minus lambda times 5f derivative we keep the constants only so lambda times 5 and then 10c and 500 are constants derivative are just zero so that will be it now we do the same with respect to clothing the Lagrange derivative with respect to clothing f square is a constant because f and anything else is a constant that's just zero c to the power 2 derivative becomes just 2c minus lambda times this one goes away because it's a constant and then 10c derivative is just 10 so 10 equals to zero now again we can see that we have lambda on both sides so that should ring a bell that we will do something about it so let's transfer them on each side 2f equals to lambda times 5 and here we have 2 times c is equal to lambda times 10 let's leave lambda on one side only so let's actually go below so we have more space to write we have now um, 2f divided by 5 equals to lambda from the first and then 2c divided by 10 equals to lambda from the second we can do some some simplification here 2 and 10 they cancel out so 2 and 10 we have only 5 meaning that now we have lambda equals to 2 over 5 times f and here lambda is equal to c over 5 or we could write it as 1 over 5 times clothing now lambda is equal to lambda which means that 2 over 5 times f is equal to 1 over 5 times clothing and again we can cancel out something 5 and 5 go away because they're both denominators on both sides and it's an equation so we can do it 2 times f equals to clothing and now this relationship we will substitute it or plug it in our budget constraint and our budget constraint is over here so we take this and put it over there now let's move to the right to have space and solve that 5 times f so we got 5 times f plus 10 times c is equal to 500. Instead of clothing, we'll use 2 times f. So we have 5 times f plus 10 times 2 times f, because that's the same as the clothing, equals to 500. So now we have 5f plus 10 times 2, 20f equals to 500. 5 plus 20, that's 25f is equal to 500 and the optimal consumption of food is 500 divided by 25 which is equal to 20 units so that's 20 units that's one answer and then how can we calculate the clothing well just by substituting because clothing is twice as much so clothing will be equal to 2 times 20 which is equal to 40 and that's it we are done